Yesterday afternoon, we got uh, intelligence that uh, a white bus was being loaded at uh, Legoshi Beach with the uh, petroleum products. So consequently, we dispatched our quick response team to the location. But on getting there, the boat and the bus had uh, disappeared from the location. But we didn't just stop uh, at that. We had to carry out uh, further surveillance of the general area which led us to the discovery of this uh, private uh, apartment being used as uh, what I can call an illegal fuel depot. And the apartment belongs to uh, the chief uh, suspect, one Mr. Ahmed Ariyo, who is also here and to be handed over uh, very soon. So what is more worrisome is uh, the fact that uh, an apartment of uh, this nature is being used as an illegal foil depot, not even uh, minding the economic implications, the security uh, implications for the general area. For example, this place goes on flame. What happens to the other residents, uh, you know, around uh, the owner? So it is uh, in line with this uh, discovery that we felt that uh, we have to hand over the suspect and the storage uh, facilities that you can see behind us here to the appropriate uh, government uh, agency, which is the Nigeria C Security and Civil Defense uh, Corps, with their commander here uh, with us this morning. Uh, from what you can see behind, uh, we have uh, uh, 8 by 50,000 storage capacity tanks. So, but they are not uh, fully filled. So, uh, Cumulatively, in the eight tanks, we have about 57,000 uh, liters of uh, AGO. Then uh, we have uh, this tanker here, which is just filled uh, with about 7,000 liters of the same product. Then uh, the white bus, which I gave us uh, the, the lead to this place, is filled uh, with uh, 30 jerry cans of uh, 50,000 liters. That is about 1,500 liters. So in all, we have about uh, 65,500 liters of AGO. And if you go by the current market price of uh, AGO in the market, that is about uh, 89 million or 90 million naira. So supposing the tanks, the eight tanks, especially those ones behind, are you know, fully filled, you have uh, about uh, 400,000 uh, liters of AGO, which will amount to over 500 uh, a million naira. So those are the things we are going to, of course, we, we hand over the products, the storage facilities and the suspects to the NSCDC. Uh, from our preliminary findings, uh, they got, uh, it could be through uh, breaking of pipe, that is pipeline vandalism, it could be through some uh, illegal vendors at sea, the name of uh, what we call the uh, ROB, that is remain on board, that is ships that come uh, to the harbor to conduct their operations, whatever they have left in their tanks, they can sell to, you know, uh, people like uh, the suspects, you know, to, to make uh, some quick money. Uh, it could also be through some other illegal means along the coastline, maybe through operation of private jetties, illegal uh, uh, loading points, and what the Navy is, uh, it's not going to relent in this effort to, to tackle oil theft in all its uh, ramifications head on. And this is uh, what the uh, Chief of Naval Staff, Vice Admiral Emmanuel Kichuko Gala, Admiral Timid, has uh, given as a directive very clear to all the command to stamp out the maritime environment of oil theft in all forms, whether it's crude oil, whether it's a refined product. An illegal business of this nature cannot be a one-man show. You will definitely have collaborators, both uh, on the interland and at sea. 
Yesterday I visited the Western Ever Command and I see for collaboration of this day. So I was happy when I was called yesterday that the decision and discovery of this legend was made and that the building and taking over will be taking place today. So I was very happy that those who are sabotaging the economy of the country, one of them has been caught. So it was worrisome because of the fact that uh, despite all the campaigns and all the efforts that has been made, some people still find it uh, very necessary for them to still carry out this kind of illegal activity. We are always uh, on daily basis hunting for them. Like uh, the general just said, we continue with the investigation. So and as soon as we complete the investigation, the suspect will be taken to court for proper prosecution mm -hmm. so that it will act as deterrent to others. Uh, I don't have much to say. It's like yesterday, the I'm at home, the Navy people came here. I saw them outside of the gate and I came down. And look when I came down and I come and meet them, they asked me, I made the idea about me that I'm doing taking market from the sea. I said, yes, I don't normally take market from the sea, but the one I take at times they bring thirty liters and thirty cakes, twenty cakes at times they gave me something like that. So it's uh, that is what I think. Now look at it. Sandy. The uniform man now met me that who are the people that bring the, the product for me? Something like that. I asked them that the people that bring the produce product for me, you know, they are working under uh, they are working closer to the ship people. The ship normally send them food, at times they send them water to bath, something like that. We use their money to go and buy the water. They will bring put the water inside the boat and go and charge into the ship. That water is what they normally use to bath, something like that. So after using that, you will use their money to do the expenses. After then, when they discharge, when the ship discharge put the arrow be that was the bottom of the ship. They, are, they give to them. They will tell them to come and take at times 30 cake, at times 20, at times 40 cakes. They will give to them. So me do buy from them. They will say to me, I will buy. For me to have my small, small little profit that I can use to feed my family and my son. Okay. Yes. This and I do I look from I look from depot. You live from depot as I well. live from depot. And you have the right clearance to live from depot. I have, I have the baby, I have everything that, uh, that permit me to load in the I load from depot. But with I, trailer. I love with trailer. I love fifty thousand liters. I love forty five thousand liters from depot. Right. Papa. Papa. Yes, Papa. The uh, the agent. That normally load me, I can call them. So actually, the who I'm doing <laughs> is it like why is it like they told me that why they load put the cabs and load the case and most of the people that give me the product that the one that you put the market into the case and bring for me. So oh, like buy from them. And at times most of the cabs I myself I buy. I used to give my customer the people that want to buy like 50, 100 liters, mm. I put it, at least that cake has normally sell it for them to put the product, 5,000. Who, who, no. yeah, who are usually your customers? The customer there, that was the people that normally use, use yeah, it to run the gen, like something like Jamaha, okay. that is, that we use at times. You supply them, you supply uh, them, supply them, uh, supply them with their cakes. For so how long have you been in this business? Yes, I've been doing this business for long. Let's assume I've been doing this business for five years now. Mm -hmm. And I went to bank to explain myself to the bank to assist me. Are they going to assist me? But I have no mother, I have no father. Okay. So, so it's, 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 it's bank that loans you money to start the loan from the bank? It's the bank that assists me some money. Loan? So, yeah, loan. Like how much? Um, they assist me some 50, like 50 million. What year was that? Mm -hmm. Five years ago. Ah, it has been long, sir. Fifteen so million from the bank. Okay, gradually. Uh, so interest. how these tanks you have here, how did you uh, construct it? Was it? Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thank you, sir, for that question. This tank, the tank I have here, this tank, I brought this tank newly. But there is one place somewhere here. The, uh, the, just reno bought, just the renovation, the, the renovation of the uh, filling station. The one, the one they took the tank they put under the okay. ground, the ground tank. So they are renovated. So, they, are renovated. so they said they don't want to use them. it as fill stations again. So I went there, I buy. But they sold, they um, sold, they sold four for me. Okay. I brought four from them, something like that, and they sold it cheaper for me. At how much? Something like that. 
So I brought the issues of the tank, I brought it to 1.5. Okay. Right, last um, question. Is this a company legally registered under the um, CSC? Yes, Ahmed Ario and Sons Nigeria Limited. Is it legally registered under CSC? It's not legally registered. It's not legally registered. Mm. Yeah, just, and you open the bank account with it? I open with Ahmed. Ahmed Ario. So you are operating a bank account not with your company name, but your personal account? Your personal account. All right, thank you.